So what I really uh, want to start focusing on is the needs, the needs, what uh, we really need on the ground over there. Some of the challenges we're seeing as, as a medical profession, people are at risk for certain diseases. Let's start with infectious diseases because that's another of our specialty, uh, what we do. Uh, so enteric pathogens, uh, salmonella, E. coli, uh, we need a lot of antibiotics for these kind of diseases. Other viruses like norovirus as well. We see uh, diseases, uh, animal-borne diseases. For example, we have uh, rat urine, uh, which gives you leptospirosis, which can be potentially deadly. That is something we need to watch out as well. So we need a lot of antibiotics for that. The biggest other problem I see, uh, what people don't really talk about so much, is diabetic medications. Remember, we have high blood pressure, blood pressure cholesterol, things of that. But what's really important is insulin. I mean, if one doesn't get their insulin for a couple of days, you know, you can have catastrophic consequences where the patient actually has to go into the ER uh, for a condition we call diabetic ketoacidosis. They usually go to the ICU for that. The other important thing we need to talk about is oxygen. Uh, COPD patients who require oxygen all the time, a lot of people are not getting that. So these are some of the medical uh, things that we're assessing. What Heal Corp needs to really be um, really be on the, a force on the ground is your uh, contributions from medicines, um, other things like blankets, socks, a lot of this coming about. We are running operations. Uh, we've had our helicopter operation, which uh, where we operate from Black Mountain. We went into certain communities where uh, medicines were not could not be uh, got because the roads are all blocked with the flooding. We're able to distribute supplies, uh, food as well. And the other thing is we see, because this is such a deep canopy over there, we actually are getting in uh, mules and horses. We have uh, 17 horses and 10 mules on the way. This will, of course, get to areas where helicopters can't land. So we're doing an extensive operation over here, but we need a lot of help. Uh, the people are really suffering. They're out of groceries. One thing I also want to mention is uh, make sure these groceries are all boiled. Uh, water has to be boiled because you certainly put yourself at risk for various infectious diseases. 